Um, it started out a little quick this year, which I expected. There was a lot more girls kind of coming over from track, so uh, and the course is pretty runnable for the first few miles. So um, I've been training more on the ultra side lately, so that first two miles felt pretty fast to me. So I was probably in third or fourth um, for a good bit, and Allie just gapped the field from the beginning, which I expected. She's a really strong runner. Um, so Casey and I worked together for most of the race, and I think I passed her into third for the NACAC and second for the US champs. Um, probably with about two miles to go when we started the big climb. So and I felt strong on the climb, so just kind of kept moving forward. So another US team. Uh, yep. Of course, you're just returning from the World Long Distance uh, Running Championships. Yep. And so how did you feel you recovered from that? Obviously, um, it's a tough race. Yeah, actually, I was a lot more beat up than I thought I would be. It was a pretty runnable course. Um, and that, as opposed to this, it had up down. And the downhill is kind of what tears you up. So. It took me a couple more days to recover than I thought, and just the travel over from Poland. So um, I turned around fine. I wasn't worried about it for this race, but I, I definitely was a little beat up. Well, we're excited that you're back in school, taking a class, yes. so that you're eligible for the collegiate side of things. And uh, we really appreciate you being part of it. Um, what is your plans from? What are your plans from here? You say you're training for an ultra. I'm actually running Leadville in six weeks. So yes. probably starting tomorrow, it's lots of volume and just getting my legs used to that. Uh, long, long, long run. So it's my first hundred. We'll see how it goes, but I'm excited. Excellent. Well, we wish you luck.